Hello everybody, how are we all doing? If you're new here then hello, my name is Kelsey Hutchings and I'm owner of Elska Beauty which is a salon in Hampshire. Now today we're going to be doing a try on haul of all the bits and bobs that really caught my eye in the new Miss Pap collaboration with Miss Jocelyn who is an influencer. I absolutely love her style so I was excited for this launch. Carry on watching if you want to see how I got on. Okay, so this is the scoop neck knit dress in a size 12 and it is £30. For a bit of reference, I am 5 foot 8 and typically a 8 to 10 um, on top and a 12 like when it comes to like play suits and dresses, just for length and I don't like things being super fitted. <sighs> I'm sorry, I'm absolutely melting. It's one of them days today where I've been like running around and now I'm just super hot. So apologies if every now and again I'm just like... I'm not a summer gal, all right? I struggle in anything above 25. <laughs> right, so, this, I haven't got quite the right pants on for this, so please ignore me. I didn't think this dress was like see-through and I've got dark pants on, so shout out to H&M pants. <laughs> but I do really love this color. You'll notice in the video there's a bit of a green theme going on. So yeah, but I imagine this is like a beach cover-up type dress. It comes down to like just above my ankles. It's got a slit up the side. Um, it does feel like a really nice material. I don't know how I feel about long sleeve for a beach cover up because guess what? On holiday I'm melting too. So yeah, but I do I do really like the colour. I do really like the material. Um, but yeah, almost a bit annoying that it's see through because I think as a normal dress I would quite like it. But there we go, guys. Blush colour as we can see. Okay, so this top isn't actually part of the uh, Miss Jocelyn collection, I just really liked it and it goes with her shorts. Uh, this is the knitted keyhole cutout top in a size 12 and it's £14.40 so it was 20% off. I probably could have got away with a 10 um, but I don't like things being tight like I said so here we are. And these are the toweling shorts in a size 12 which were 18 Now if you have watched my past clothing hauls you will know that anything that has anything remotely stringy tie uppy like this I get very confused and the same just happened again that's partly due to the label is actually upside down so I actually put the top on upside down and that absolutely blew my mind but here we are took me a little while so let me just tell you ladies these tops aren't as easy to put on as you might think they are but we got there in the end I feel like wearing this out I probably put some of the like nipple pad things on just to protect yourself a little bit you know um, but yeah, I feel like this all this this bit needs like a bit of manipulation and you sort of need to pull up this bit and this bit and do what suits you. But I do actually like the top. Um, it's quite different for me. But I'm hopefully going on holiday soon. So I feel like it has like holiday vibes. Um, you know, with like nude skirt, uh, shorts or even just denim. So yeah, I do quite like the top. Not sure what I think of the shorts. I do think they're quite nice. They feel nice. But I don't know if they're like £18 nice. You feel me? Do you ever ask that? Ask yourself that? So yeah, do like them, but don't know if I £18 like them. Just turn my ring light off so you can see which I'm talking about. I just tried on this dress in a size 12. Couldn't even get it over my bum. So, like I say every clothes haul, clothes sizes do my head in. Okay, so this is the high-waisted shorts in lime, size 12, 25, matching cropped shirt in a size 10, which was 20. Now, I love this colour. Please ignore my hair for now. I'm just melting. I hate this heat. <sighs> That's not but here we are. But yeah, I hate this heat, so please just ignore my hair. But I just can't deal with this lime's mane down at the moment. So, yeah. Shorts are actually proper tight. I wouldn't be able to wear them at the moment and a bit camel toe vibes. Um, but I feel like carrying on losing a few pounds with my Courtney Black workouts and trying to put down the chocolate buttons, I think they would fit me in no time properly. So I'm actually tempted to keep them because I love this coat. But yeah, it feels nice. It's a nice cottony material. I feel like it would feel quite cool on holiday or in these summer temperatures so yeah the model on their website had them on with like some bright green heels as well which was just so yes tempted to keep them anyway to be honest 
This is the green tied side sarong in a medium, which is £30, which I did think was actually quite pricey. Oh, I wouldn't wear it with this top. <laughs> Don't worry, it's just so I'm not just stood here in my bra. Um, but I did think £30 was quite expensive for a sarong, but now I've got it here, I can actually feel why. It feels like really nice quality, it is double layered. Um, it comes down to just, it's sort of like asymmetric, but it comes down to sort of mid calf. But yeah, it does feel really nice, and I do think it would look nice with the bikini. Um, she wore the neutrally one as a skirt. I'm not sure I'd be brave enough for that just because of the whole high thigh thing. Um, but yeah, I could definitely see why girls would wear it as a skirt. It does feel really nice. So if you're fancy treating yourself to a fancy sarong, you know where to go. I did order the green bikini as well to go with this. Um, again, if you've looked at the co collection, you'll know which one I mean. It does fit really nicely. I wasn't brave enough to try that one on camera. <laughs> um, but yeah, that does fit really nicely. So I imagine that all together, that would look rather lush and green. Okay, so this is the green oversized shirt in a size 10, which is 30 pounds. But I'm <laughs> she wore it like over the top, um, over the top of a top of shorts and trainers and stuff, which is really cool. I think you could also wear it as a dress. But I'm holding it like this with my cuff still undone because I'm such a muppet and I could get away with being Kermit and all this green stuff, let's face it. <laughs> I can't get the buttons through the holes. You know when like that stitch so tightly that you just can't get the buttons through? It's starting to hurt my thumbs. I've got like markings on the end of my thumbs where I couldn't push it through. So this would be nice if we can do the buttons up. You get me? But yeah, I love the colour. Like I said, these definitely are oversized, so I would size down. I'd normally get a 12 in a shirt dress, but this is a 10. So she means it when they say oversized, but I do really like it as a uh, dress, if I could do it up. So, yeah. Did also order the swimsuit from the collection, which again um, is nice, but I feel like I might need to size up a bit because I am taller. I feel like, again, it gives a bit of tamil co tamil camel toe, but I prefer wearing bikinis on holiday anyway, to be honest, so it's all good. Just going to stand here holding this shirt close. Hope you still enjoy this clothes haul, guys. Always keeping it real over on this channel, as you can see. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe I'd really appreciate it let me know if you guys bought anything for the collection how you got on with it I do really like the collection and I love her style so big up to her and I'll see you guys don't know who I think I am saying that off to see the new Space Jam film this afternoon so I hope it is good gonna be reliving my childhood but uh, yeah I hope you guys are all well um, see you soon on my next video stay safe guys bye